What's up, y'all? It's your boy Dre41, aka Mr. 4K, aka El Fuego, Spicy Dre, and welcome to another episode of UFC Undisputed 3 Pride Mode Tournament. Man, we're gonna continue this thing off, and y'all already see what time it is, man. Y'all already see we got the legendary Anderson, the Spider Silver, and this is not his UFC um, version. This is his um, Pride Era version. So in this game, they have different versions of fighters, which is such a cool idea. I wonder why they don't do that in um, MMA games today. It's, you know what's weird, Joe? It's like, even when technology, you know, moves forward, right? As far as games go, the features or lack thereof really show when, when they really focus on just the graphics of a game. You feel me? And it's just like, people tend to forget that it's like, also, what else can you do in the game besides look at the pretty graphics? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't understand why everybody has this this weird, like, obsession with, like, a game having to look photorealistic. Like, I, I don't get it. I can enjoy a game that doesn't have to have 1080p graphics or 4K graphics or you can see the sweat beads like it's not that it is the game fun point blank is the game fun do do i have options can i do creative stupid things in the game i can't it's just a straightforward simulation game oh uh, you know what i'm saying like it's man it's it's just it's to me it's it's bothersome because it's just like a lot of people have that mindset to where they don't care about presentation they don't care about extra features. They literally live and die off of how does the game look? Does it look real? And it's like, don't, it, why does that matter so much? Why? The, the game should be fun. You know what I'm saying? And I'll go on a little little rant, little rant ski. You feel me? Just like how people talk about the AEW game. Oh, it looks like Battlegrounds. It's like, dog, shut up. As long as the game is fun, the gameplay is good, and it has a lot of features, that's all that should be important, and it plays well. Damn, it's just like people are just like, no, oh, if it doesn't look like a 2K game, it doesn't make sense. Shut up. Jump off a roof. Alright, back to this match. Um, Vitor Belfort, right? And Anderson Silva. They're both from Brazil. They're both Brazilian uh, jiu-jitsu fighters. Um, so I'm pretty sure um, they're going to keep the, the stand-up game in full effect. Anderson Silva's probably going to win that. But we'll see, though. We'll see, though. Uh, weight advantage definitely um, It doesn't go to Anderson Silva. I'll uh, say that. Vitor Belfort, uh, I feel like, definitely holds that uh, size advantage. But uh, Anderson Silva's nice. So, I mean, we'll see what happens. Right now, they're trying to go for the little grapple. This damn, oh, damn. Oh, damn. Muay Thai knees. Oh, it's going to be trouble. Somebody getting knocked out early. I was about to say, you better get out of that predicament. Because you was going to get knocked out, good brother. You was going to get up out of here. He's going to send you to the shadow realm. Ooh, that front kick is dangerous. Ooh, knee right to the ribs. And you know what? It's like another thing I was thinking about too. Just to, like, and this is not like a spoiler or anything. This is just me like saying ideas out loud. Um, like I was thinking like maybe um the wrestling code should also have like MMA, like an MMA style match option, and like moves that they would do. Oh my God, that stomp from the top is ridiculous. Um, that there should be like an MMA mode in the wrestling code, you feel me? Because it's like so many wrestlers now, they, you know, part-time train in MMA, you know what I'm saying? And I think it would be really, really cool um, to, to see that, you know, whether it's like a little octagon or whatever. I feel like that would be tough. I would like that personally. That, that's just me, though. Like, I would definitely like that. I would love to see that. I mean, that, but, you know, whatever. We'll see. I'll, I'll you know, talk to the devs see if that can happen. Um, but right now, Vitor got him up. Well, see, I was about to say he got him up against the ropes. And soon as I was about to say it, Anderson was like, nope, good old-fashioned reversal. And now they're hugging. <laughs> Collar and elbow. And right now, damn, he pushing him. Oh, he's trying to throw some Muay Thai. He, he's, yeah, he's, oh, and got the underhooks in. He gonna try to slam him? What, what is he trying to do right now? 
they are not throwing hands. I'm really surprised about like what's going on. I thought it would be like throwing hands like constantly, but I guess that Brazilian Jiu Jitsu was coming into play. Oh, all right now, going back to the hands. And like I said, as far as takedown goes, I don't think you're going to see a lot of it in here unless the computer decides to make me a liar. But you're going to see probably a lot of like, see, what? why when I start talking, the game makes me look like a jackass? Why? I should just be quiet, but I'm not. Y'all came here for my commentary, so I'm going to talk. <laughs> oh, damn, that's side control. Uh, you, there's no way for you to get up from here. Oh, he tried. He gave up. Oh, my goodness. Come on. He could have got choked out right there, to be completely honest. I think it's over now because Anderson Silva on top is over. That Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is not going to help you right now against Anderson Silva. Oh, he got to get back to his feet. He got to get back to his feet. He's trying to go for that full mount. He's trying to work it and get that full mount. I'm not sure he's going to be able to get it. That north south is going to be dangerous, though. He can throw a knee and just end it. Oh, damn. Damn, this is what we're doing. Yeah, he got to hold on. Oh, good reversal. Oh, no. Not like this. Not like this. Oh, he might go night night. Oh, damn. Full mount. Full mount. Damn, he kicked him off. Look at this. They going at it. They going at it. Yo, I love it. There's the open guard. All right, keep working. They got to keep working or the referee's going to stand them up. Damn, pushed them off. Yo, they are really, like, damn near even, really. Which I'm, like, surprised because Anderson Silva, even his um his pride era is nice. It's over. That, wow. He is not following up. Yo, oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he was able to stay in it. <laughs> he was able to stay in it. Wow, they got back to their feet. Ooh. Uh-oh. Duck that one. Ooh, that kick. I seen that kick coming from a mile away. Ooh, damn, that jab. Damn. That short jab did him the filthiest. Oh, you got to stay in it. Come on. He trying to go for that full mount. The reversal. Yo, they are really teeing off. That's it. Damn. That was a wild first mat, uh, first round. That was a wild. Look at the blood on the arms, too, yo. The cut over the eye. Yeah, he felt it. It's it just swole, boy. He looks like Elephant Man right now. It's real on these streets. Vitor hanging in there. I am thoroughly surprised. I did, I did not expect this. I, I, I'm not going to say I, I expected like a first round knockout, but I really expected it to be more along the lines of Anderson Silva being able to just do him filthy, but Belfort is staying in there. I'm, I am thoroughly surprised. I, I did not expect it. I'm going to be completely honest. But hey, let's, I mean, second round might go a little bit different. Oh, look at the prior girl, look at that. Who would have thought, not me. I forgot they had this in here. They look basic as hell. Look at those mid card girls. <laughs> They're mid. Oh, too bad. All right, let's get it. Ooh, try to throw a hook in. Ooh, uppercut. Belfort got to stay in there now. Oh, damn, that right, I mean, that left hook. And that jab that he did last um, round did um, Anderson Silva filthy. Ooh, them uppercuts. Come on now. Got to block the brother. Oh, damn. The Muay Thai knees. The Muay Thai knees. He could do him filthy with this. He's not following up with those knees. Boy, those Muay Thai knees. Oh, damn. Mm. Oh, he's down. Down he goes. It might be over. Oh, God, right to the ribs. Anderson blocking all of those, though. Vitor, what are you doing, my guy? What are you doing, my guy? Oh, damn, damn, it's over. Got to punch him in the eye. got to jab him in the eye a little bit. Get him loopy. You know, close that eye shut. It's over. Like, this, and this is why I like this game, and the controls are... Really? Lights going off, but I'm sitting here pressing damn buttons. Um, yo, like, I, I really like just how the controls were in this game. The controls were, you can tell, like, when you're trying to go for a full mount, you can tell 
Like the controls are so responsive, yo. So it was so fun. Like playing up, playing against someone was like frustrating, but it was fun because both of you were easy. Because the game it was solely based on how good you were with your controls. You feel me? But I mean, stats also matter too. So I can't. Damn, it's over. No, he keeps grabbing him. Every time I think it's over, he grabs him. Every time. It's truly amazing. Pushing him away, trying to create some right, now back to the stand up, that front kick. Oh damn. He keeps giving up. Yo, he keeps giving up positioning when he tries to go for that damn kick. Oh, the head kicks are so slow, man. You can see him from a mile away. Now still standing up, trying to Damn! That's it. Jesus lives. He knocked him smooth out. Wow! Jeez! Wow! I wouldn't go home if I got knocked out like that. Damn, bro! He said, "Oh, you try to throw it." Pow! <laughs> he went straight down. Right on the Damn, son! He tried to throw one. He did. He said, "Whoop!" Pow! <laughs> he went straight down, bro. It was over. Damn! Oh Homeboy went down. He got shot. <laughs> he went straight down. Damn, his eye damn closed, bruh. Yeah, Anderson Silva was in a fight tonight, boy. You can tell. But alright, that was good. Let's get to the next fight, man. Let's see who up next. Yeah, Thiago Alves versus Yoshihiro Akiyama. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready to see something. Listen, I'm trying to see somebody get knocked out. That last match was disrespectful as all hell. I'm, I'm just going to put it out there. That last match was wildly disrespectful. I've never, ever seen somebody knocked out like that. But see, um, Anderson Silva's good for that. He can dip something and pow, <laughs> down you go. Oh, my goodness. I mean, listen. It, but, um... The Brazilian Pitbull. Is that what's his name? No, I don't think it was. It was something like that. Thiago Alves has something like that. Or am I wrong? Is that Andre Olowski? I might be, I might be, I'm gonna be quiet. No, he had Pitbull in his arm. Yeah, here we go. I'm tripping. I, I, knew, I knew I was talking about. Damn it. Look at his introductions too, bro. It's amazing. You gotta appreciate the effort they put in this. Oh man, he got that affliction shirt. Shout outs to, never mind, I'm not even gonna say it. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it to people who wear affliction shirts. I'm gonna leave that one alone. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it alone. Oh, but I was about to say something wild. I was about to say something wild, spicy. I might still say it, but it's fine. I'm not gonna say it right now. <laughs> I caught myself. Oh boy, I really caught myself right there. I was about to say something wild. <laughs> Oh boy, we're gonna leave it alone. No. Thiago Alves, man, we're gonna see what he can do. Uh, we're definitely gonna see what he can see. This is he's 28. He's still in his prime. He, you know, got that, you know, performance enhancing, just flowing through his veins right now. It's fine. We're not gonna worry about it. Yoshihiro Akiyama. We're gonna see what he can do. He up there in age, boy. He, he's at the end of his career right now. Is that foul for me to say? I feel like that's a little bit foul. I gotta relax. <laughs> Was he the stu- No, he was- Okay, I gotta relax. I was about to say something stupid again. I feel like someone's getting knocked out here. But I feel like Akiyama- I feel like Akiyama isn't gonna throw hands. I feel like he's more of a wrestler. We'll see. I'm very intrigued. I don't know very much about Akiyama, so I'm, I, I want to see what he can do. Alves, I've seen fight plenty of times. Ooh, wait a minute, he's standing. Oh, man. Oh, this is going to be a slugfest. Oh, okay. Okay, if this is going to be a slugfest, let's go with it. Oh, wait a minute, he tried to slam it. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Combinations by Akiyama. Let's get it. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. 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 I wish Yoshi, Yoshinari um, was in here. Because he was in Pride, but, you know, he was still wrestling. But he was freelance. Was he ever, like, really signed anywhere? Like, was he signed to, like, a specific wrestling company? Or am I tripping? I don't know. Right now, he took it to the ground. 
I don't know what's going to happen here. Like I said, I don't know much about Akiyama. Um, so Thiago is who I know, like, he, he can throw hands. So I'm going to see. Well, we're going to see, actually. Front kick. That didn't go nowhere. Straight jab. Trying to throw some weak-ass kicks. Now, see, that head kick right there was fast. That was a fast head kick. Damn, they're just trying to kick each other up. Trying to go. Damn. Took him down. Okay. And now what's he going to do here? So, yeah, for me, with this one, yo, um, once again, yo, the one thing that I do have to say about this game that I, that I kind of didn't like, when creating a fighter, they didn't have as many names that you can say. Like, they had, like, a nickname, but the first names, they never say first names. They just said um, their, your last name. But they didn't have a, a big... Uh, a big selection of last names. You know what? I might do a creative fighter mode review for this game. I just might. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Now look at this. Ooh, single leg. Okay. We'll clip him up a little bit. Got him down to the ground. I'm not sure what he's trying to do because I don't see any submissions. Ooh, a head kick. Oh, damn. German? No. Wait a minute. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? I remember I knocked someone out with a German suplex in this game. And they, yeah, they got German suplexes in this game. Like actual German suplexes. And they're beautiful. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Don't get scared, Thiago. Fight back. Throw some hands. You stay trying to grab. Move. Okay. Let's work it out now. Yeah, I wish they had better name calls in this game. But other than that, oh, and the weight class and the height. Like, having limitations on the height, I feel like, was, uh, uh, mm, wasn't was great. I get it with, like, certain, like, you know, weight classes. You don't want to make some dude who's six feet tall facing a like, featherweight or flyweight or something. I get that. But still, it, it's possible, you know. It's possible. Oh, Jack. And what if a six feet tall dude was in featherweight? That'd be wild. Uh oh, double leg. Because his, his reach would be crazy, but then again, it's like those long limbs. But you know what I'm saying? You can get worked really easily. Oh, duck that. Look at that. Okay, Akiyama, do your thing, your brother. Oh, damn. Damn. He's running into those. Oh, and a little bit back and forth here. They've thrown that boxing out. You gotta watch out for um, Alves on um, those, those head kicks. But those things is quick. Oh, judo throw. Okay. My guy. Oh, kicked him off. There we go. That defense is showing. That defense is showing. Oh, damn. He tried to get back to his feet. He was like, nah, good brother. We ain't trying to hit that one at all. Uh oh. Side control. Trying to throw those knees. Ah, uh, they're gonna have to get back to their feet. They're definitely, because they're not doing a damn thing on the ground. They're not trying to go for no submission, no nothing. There we go. Ooh, ooh. Made him jump a little bit. Made him jump. I like that. They teeing off. They just got to. Yo, those takedowns, bro. We ain't going to no referee decision. I seriously doubt that. I seriously doubt we're going to a referee decision. I need to see a knockout. Mm. He holding on. We, we're going to get past the first. Damn. I said we about to get past the first round. I'm like, mm, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Oh, he's trying to throw those bombs. All right, you gotta have to get out of this. You gotta have to get out of get out of this predicament right now. There's 20 seconds left. He can still get knocked out. Nah, he's he's good. He's good. This is gonna go to round number two. Yeah, this is definitely going to round number two. Ah, Kiyama is safe. We'll try to go for a judo. We'll try to go for it again. That's it. And we are going to the second round. He hung in there. Wow, okay. He hung in there. That's good, though. Like, yo, the graphics on this man are really, really good. Yo. Like, real talk, you can... I mean, I'm not going to say it's perfect. Like, you can tell it's on 360, but you can tell, like, they, like this was towards, like, you know, this was multiple years in on the 360, so they they were definitely well, well-trained developers to be able to get the most out of the systems. So they did their thing. Also, I got the DLC for this game too. Did I get all the DLC though? I don't know. I remember <laughs> I remember when I was creating fighters, right? Like in this one, 
you couldn't just freely create a fighter and make his stats the way you wanted. So basically you had to buy points. I wish I could still buy points in this. Because I would have had like multiple fighters in their right overalls. But in this you have to play through um, career mode and get them boosted up in order to do that. So it is what it is. But I was buying points like crazy. I wish I was I had the foresight to just buy mad points and just, you know, get guys, you know, to levels to where I wanted them to. Ooh, spinning back fist. Okay. Okay, he was watching a couple of Eddie Kingston matches. You know what time it is. Oh, okay, now they're throwing hands. Oh, dude, look at him ducking, Diego. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, oh damn, slam his ass. Alright, now what are they gonna do with it, though? Oh, trying to throw those bombs. But he got good defense. Akiyama has good defense, though. I don't know, Alves might not be able to do too much on the ground. Because his ground, his ground defense is amazing right now. He's really able to stay in there against Alves, so... I'm not sure. They're gonna have to stand up and see where they see where they can hold off on each other or tee off. Sorry. Yeah, he got him. He got him booked on the ground. There's nothing he can do. So yeah, better off just standing up. Somebody gonna get flash knocked out. Hey, yo, that head kick is so fast. That's a snappy head kick. And he's still trying to use that judo. Like, I, and it's working for the most part. So I don't know. Now I got the. Underhooks in. Trying to keep the advantage. Collar and elbow. I don't know too much, man. Oh, judo. Oh, try to go for that judo throw. Try to. I don't know why, because it's like... Ooh! STL, uh, STO right there. Oh. Alright, now he's trying to get... Trying to get full mount. I don't know his ground game. I think they null and void each other's ground game, so I don't understand why they keep trying to take it to the ground. It kind of doesn't make sense to me. Oh damn! Oh damn! Get it together, good brother. Oh, punch to the head. Multiple punches to the head. Wait a minute. Trying to throw some knees. Damn! Punch right to the head. Oh damn! He's dizzy. He's dazed and confused, folks. It might be over right here. This might be it. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. Oh, he's holding on. Oh, he is really hanging in there. Like, this is, this is bugging me out. Like, he's really hanging in there. Wow, we're going to a third round. We're going to a third round. I did not expect it. I am so... Are we going to a referee's decision? Is that what we're doing out in these streets? Or is it just two rounds? Is it two rounds? Was that three? Wait a minute. What, am, what is going on here? <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't know who won. I'm so serious. Like, I don't know who won. Like, this is bugging me out right now. I, don't, I really do not know who walked away with a victory here. Like, this is this is a bit confusing. Bow! Look at that. But he had, yo, I, I feel like Alphys won? Because he had Akiyama rattled a bit. And we all want to know, and now let's see what the judges Wow, it was three rounds. I'm tripping. Alphys. Alves. Alves won! Hell yeah, I was about to say. Akiyama got a bag of like like he had it. Like what? He won by decision. I don't get it. Well, 